Okay guys, so today is a cook day and um, last night was so bad. We actually looked in our refrigerator and in our cupboards and we had nothing. So we ended up going to the grocery store about eight, nine-ish last night, got a bunch of stuff and today we're making quite a few things. We made our rice, we're making a chili, we're making a barbecue tofu and I believe stir fry and spaghetti. So we're gonna have quite a few things to put in the freezer and then we'll have things for this week and next week because that's how we usually cook. And I think everything that we bought yesterday was um, about $88 and then today we bought like 20-ish. So anyways, it was close to maybe like $100 for two weeks of food. Um, and we bought a big bag of rice that was, how many pounds? 20 pounds. 20 pound bag of rice for like $10. So we're filling it and we're doing good. Hey guys, um, we're at It's Sugar and behind me is popcorn. Isn't this cool? But I checked them and a lot of them have um, wheat in it and it has milk. So I, it's nothing I can buy. but. It's still cool. Okay, so today has been a really fun day. We went to Costco and this guy was dressed like Santa Claus. I was so excited. My heart just kind of immediately went out. Um, I, I don't even know how to describe him. He was wearing red shirt, red pants, black suspenders. He had the white beard, the white hair. That was like maybe down to here. I mean, he he was Santa Claus. And so I, you know, like how you feel as a kid, your heart just immediately goes out. You trust the guy, you love the guy. I loved him. The minute I saw him, I loved him. He was Santa Claus. Um, I probably would have tried to get my picture with him, but he already had like little kids going up to him. So I was thinking, yeah, I'll, Obviously, you know, I'll leave him alone. Plus, um, I was with Emery, so if Emery wasn't there, I probably would not have behaved so well. I probably would have went up and been like, Santa Claus, Santa Claus. Okay, I know I'm way too old for this, but he was a cool guy. I mean, whose heart does not go out to people who look like Santa Claus, you know, just excited. Anyways, uh, so then we went out and this little girl came up to me and she was like, do you drive a green car? And I was like, well, I didn't drive my car here. So I was thinking like maybe she was asking if I had a green car out in the parking lot. So I said, no, I, I don't drive a green car. I didn't drive a green car. And then the mom goes, oh, well, we see somebody who drives a green car and she looks just like you. And I, I said, okay, well, I have a green car. I didn't drive it here but I do have a green car. It's very bright. One of my girlfriends calls it the green pea. Um, so I told her, yeah, I do have a green car. And she said, oh, every day at, on our way to our school commute, we see somebody and they, she looks just like you. So I started laughing. I'm like, well, that's probably me then. So the mom on their way out, she was like, we'll see you on Monday. <laughs> So I was just thinking, God, I hope I behave because last week I got kind of mad at a car that cut me off and I did honk, but I never honk. I never blow my horn because it just makes me nervous and I'm not that type of person. But that day I got kind of mad and I was thinking, God, this is why you don't misbehave because you never know who's like watching, right? So I will try to keep my temperament under control because this little girl was so cute. I mean, she was young. She was in a little soccer uniform. So obviously they had a soccer tournament for the day and they were going out for, for lunch after the soccer game because that's what we used to do when my brother was in soccer. We would go out as a family and as a team and things like that. So, you know, it was just really neat. It was, she was a neat little girl. So anyways, that it's just been a very busy, productive day. And I am 
thinking that maybe Sunday I should make something to eat special. We were going to make biscuits, but Emery's doing his fast. So, um, probably not going to do biscuits this weekend because he needs to, you know, he doesn't want to be a certain weight when he does his fast. He wants to be at a good starting weight. And our weekends are really bad. He always ends up about nine pounds more than he wants to be before the week week starts so we've been really good we haven't been buying popcorn or anything lately so hopefully um we can keep on that track oh my gosh the dogs are going crazy uh we went to costco yesterday and they had samples so we tried this um bitchin is it a bitchin sauce and it it's very very little but there's a, like a little thing right here that says it's vegan and um it's i believe it said it was gluten free anyways uh yeah i don't see anything anyways so i tried the um which one was it oh, okay hi baby oh i tried the spinach artichoke artichoke one on this and it was so funny because you know, being vegan, it's really hard finding treats that are, um, that are vegan and gluten-free that taste good. So I tried it, right? And it was so good. So I got kind of excited. I'm like, oh my God, this is so good. Emery, we have to buy this. And this lady comes up next to me and she looks at the guy serving the food and she goes, I want to have what she had. And it totally made me think of that one scene when that woman faked her, um, Okay, well, I don't know if I could say the word, but anyway, so she was like, you know, faking it, and and the people at the restaurant, one of the women at the restaurant goes, I want to have what she has, so I kind of felt like that was my scene, because I was super excited about having this vegan, gluten-free snack, so we ended up buying it, it I think it was like um, $9.99 for the three-pack, so... Emery's getting into them now. Yeah, so it comes with this. This one is toasted green chili. So that's one. And then the one that I had was. Does it. Where does it say what it is? Okay. Um, okay, so no, this one is the green onion. And then this one is the artichoke. So it's good that it comes with like the little plastic on top because Emery is, oh my gosh, hi. You guys, you guys, you got snacks all day today. All day today. Yes, you did. Oh my gosh, they are just like ready for more snacks. Are you ready for more snacks? Do you, oh, oh, this is our, our chubby boy. He, um, he was like 16 pounds and we got him down to 12, but his sister, who's taller than him, same, um, I don't actually, I think she's a poodle mix and I don't know what he is. He's a mix of something too. Um, Mozart, come on, look, look, you're on camera. Oh, you're on camera. Okay, <laughs> um, so we finally got him down to 12, but she is 11 pounds. So anyways, we're going to try these, and um, I don't know which one I want to try. Emery, which one of these did you try? I tried the, the uh, green onion. Oh, okay. Was it pretty good? Yeah. Typo, jeez Louise. She's licking the lids on these. I'm glad the lids uh, are on them because these dogs have no idea what personal space is and what is mine and what is not yours. Mm -hmm.